Hi. Hello. <laughs> I'm Jessica and this is Lois from, she hasn't decided what her name is, but I'll link her channel below. <laughs> We're going to play That's a Porky, otherwise known as Bullsh**. This is the family friendly edition, apart from the fact that you just said it anyway. Family friendly. <laughs> <laughs> How this game works is one of us has to declare something that they know. For example, this practice round is colours. I'm going <laughs> to start with 10 as my first bid. I think I can name 11 colours. I think I can name 12 colours. I think I can name 15 colours. I think I can name 20 colours. You're telling a porky. Okay. <laughs> so now she has to name all 20 of her colours. If she can do it, she gets the point. Okay. If she can't, I get the point. Loser has to dress up in a banana costume, thank you. 20 colours, off okay, you go. Okay, all right, let's see. Okay. Red, yellow, pink, red and yellow and pink and brown and scarlet and black and ochre and peach and orange and grey. Okay, I, this was a song that I forgot the words to. Okay, right, yeah, I was telling Porky. If I remember the words to the song, then I would be able to. You started with like the normal song, like red and yellow and pink and then you said brown. Okay, I am trying to sing a song from Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat, which is a musical which names all the many, many colours in his coat. But I've not watched or listened to that in a long time. So I thought that, you know, you know how you just remember song lyrics? Yeah. I thought I would just remember the song lyrics, but. Okay, so long story short, I win. But it's a practice round, so it doesn't count. Oh, red, right, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. So um, I hope you understood the gist of the game. Now we're going to start. <laughs> oh dear, I'm not feeling too optimistic now, to be honest. Well, I think I can name five birds. Um, I'm going to go with six birds. I think I can name 10 birds. 11 birds. 12 birds. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna risk it and say that's a porky. <laughs> okay, oh, the pressure, the pressure. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so. It's like being on a quiz show, isn't it? Like, I know. You think you know all the answers when you're watching at home, but then. Okay, penguin. <laughs> There's actually lots of types of penguin. I'm, uh, I'm destroying myself, it doesn't matter. Penguin, robin, <laughs> chicken, blackbird, magpie, wren, blue tit, great tit, Ooh, green woodpecker. Oh my gosh, ostrich. Am, am I actually blanking? This can't be. Peacock. Kingfisher. I got one more. Pigeon. Oh, fair <laughs> I was thinking maybe we should have established a time limit before we actually started playing the game. Yeah, so but I, I feel like that was fair enough. Well, okay, well I've done. got one point. Well done. You did. Okay. <laughs> We're going to go with. Countries. I think I can name 10 countries. 13 countries. 15 countries. I think I can name 20 countries. You're telling a porky. Okay, right. <laughs> Ecuador, Peru, Bolivia, Chile, Argentina, Uruguay, Paraguay, Brazil, France, Germany, Spain, Portugal, um, Germany, where have I said Germany already? I think so. Hungary, Romania, Bulgaria, Greece, America, North America, United States, Canada, um, Sweden, Norway. Yeah, yeah. well done. Oh, there we go. <laughs> well done. Yay. Well. Should I do something that we're not confident on? Okay. I think I can name one beer brand. <laughs> I think I can name two beer brands. I think I can name three beer brands. Oh, I think I can name four beer brands. You're telling a porky. <laughs> Okay, okay, right. Koppenberg? I think so. Okay. <laughs> Heineken? Yeah. There's one called Doom Bar. I think that's what it's called. I'm thinking of stuff I sell at Tesco. Okay, oh, that's so unfair that you... Oh, I didn't realise you had that advantage. And then, finally... Uh, oh my goodness. I think I've lost. <laughs> I think of another beer brand. <laughs> yes! I win! I, was, I mean, I had three in mind, and then I was like, you said three, so I'm like, can I think of something else on the spot? I'm trying to think now, can I there's actually think of another beer brand? Carlsberg. Okay. But that's only because it used to be the sponsors of Liverpool. Oh, you know what? I should have said this place called Titanic Brewery, because my dad really likes them. <laughs> I got two points. Yay, two. Okay, I need to think of one more. And now I feel just as pressured thinking of a topic as I do actually coming <laughs> up with the answers. Okay, I have an idea. Just animals. Animals, okay. Yeah. I think I can name 10 animals. I think I can name 
11 animals. I think this is unfair because you've been reading a book about animals very recently. You want 11, did you say? Yeah. That wasn't very ballsy. Yeah, I know. I went straight for 10 and you're just like, oh, 11. I know, but last time I tried with the bear, it didn't go well. That was only one step as well. Yeah, I know, exactly. That's why I don't think I can go more than one step. Okay, I think I can, I can name 15 animals. Okay, I'm going to go 16 animals. What are these steps? <laughs> because I'm not feeling very risky. I think I can name 20 animals. I'm gonna go 21 animals. I think you're turning a porky. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness, I feel like I'm quite a risk averse person. <laughs> this game is really stressful. <laughs> can we count that animal I said to you earlier that I think is its name? A caiman? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> of course. It is called could, a caiman. <laughs> that was what it was called. Okay, right, okay. So I guess we'll start with caiman. Yeah. Uh, alligator, crocodile. We're gonna have to look if a caiman is one of those two. Because if a caiman is a crocodile or an alligator, then the caiman doesn't count. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's separate, or at least it was in the book that I was reading, <laughs> hopefully. Um, Frog, rattlesnake, cobra, black mamba, python, grass snake. <laughs> now you said about snakes, I'm feeling really inspired by snakes. <laughs> A rabbit, hare, rock badger, <laughs> tortoise, a turtle, turkey, penguin, blackbird, a blue tit. <laughs> oh no, I feel sabotage. Ostrich, a leopard, a tiger, cheetah. I have no, no idea how many I've said at this point. You've um, said 22, but I don't know if some of them count. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, I can keep going if you like. Maybe um, two more. Or okay, a shark, a killer whale, okay, a dolphin, a. Pigeon. You win. Okay, you win. A rat. Everyone <laughs> loves rats. Whew. I was thinking about flowers, but I don't know how confident I am about that. You know, actually. I knew you were going to say that. That's because everywhere I look, there's flowers. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you've got rocks. You could do rocks. Rocks. Yeah, I can't say I feel particularly <laughs> confident about rocks. Okay, let's do flowers. I think I can name five flowers. I'm trying to work out if I can <laughs> name five flowers or not. Don't take your time. Like, oh my goodness <laughs> me. I'm trying to think if I can. Okay, I'm going to say, I feel, uh, I'm not sure that that is a porky, but I don't think I can name more. So, so I don't know what to do. Why did you get to start anyway? <laughs> I'm going to go six. I'm going to go seven. <laughs> Oh, there's no way I'm going in a seven, so I'm going to say that's a porky. Daisies, dandelions, lotus, lilies, roses, sunflowers, lavender, heather. I'm above it now anyway, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, anyway. School subjects. I'm going to start at six. I'm going to say I can name eight. I'm going to go up to ten. Ew, God, do I want to name ten in a stressful environment? Oh, no, I don't want to name ten. You're turning porky. Can I have English language and English literature? There's different subjects. If you absolutely have to, but I don't think you should be allowed that. <laughs> okay, fine. I'll put it as one. Maths, psychology, physics, biology, chemistry, history, geography. They now have philosophy at Impington, so. Okay. Uh, religious education. That's yeah. fine. Well done. Thank you. Is that that little face? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Jess got, got some little, uh, it's not focusing. It's not focusing. Wait. Uh, where's the, where even is the, the camera? Up there? <laughs> <laughs> it's a smiley face. Let me tell the audience's destiny. I don't believe in this. But you have to. Um, I have a mixture of different emotions here. And whichever one I pick, I'll pick it at random. It's how your day is going to go today. But come on, you can't do this. <laughs> you can't tell them they're going to have a sad day if you get a sad one. Well, that's what horoscopes do every day. <laughs> yeah, I know. I don't believe in that. I feel like your day is going to be pretty boring and mediocre. Well, I think because you've watched this video, you're going to be very happy. Um, I'm not finding much inspiration around here. Should we do one on the way? Like in the train or something? Off we go. Hello. Hello. So we've come to the zoo and... I was going to say, do you need me to hold it? Because I'm taller than you. <laughs> really? like... I don't know if that's rude or not. <laughs> yeah, but otherwise my head's going to be cut off, isn't it? Should I stand on this side? Yeah. There that? we go. That's better. Then again, you are left-handed, so I don't know why that didn't work. Yeah, but I can hold it in my right hand. <laughs> Hello, today we're at the zoo. <laughs> we're at the zoo um, looking for inspiration to finish this game, but we realised that we've already done animals. Yeah. So we decided to settle this on a game of rock, paper, scissors. Are you ready? <laughs> okay, yes. Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors. scissors. Jess, Jess lost. And uh, that means she's going to have to be the one to dress up here in the zoo. Here are some monkeys. But today we're giving them the show. <laughs> this is so embarrassing. You look great. It's on. The monkeys are just thinking, that is a treat over there. What a snack. Does it look good 
Oh, it looks great. Keep going. Don't stop. <laughs> There's one. There's no orangutan. It's just hanging around. Hey Lois, what's a ghost's favorite fruit? I don't know. What is a ghost's favorite fruit? A uh, boo, nana. <laughs> I don't think he's impressed. Where are we now? We're by the gorillas. They're actually. They've all went over to the other side now. You're scaring them. Jess, Jess, hello. Are you there? <laughs> Yellow. <Yeah, no. laughs> Finch about how Santa Claus does exist. Oh really? Yeah, it's by Jonathan Pujo. But I don't think he wrote it. He did a video. And someone else wrote an article. And it's about how like other people are embodying Santa and Santa is still a force in the world. Even, That's actually yeah. quite interesting. Yeah, yeah. I was thinking about it, about how you're saying you're no longer a person, you're now a banana. Yeah. Hey Lois, what kind of key opens a banana? I don't know, what kind of key opens a banana? A monkey. Are you with the Kind of. 